righty. Prepare for um, a lot of construction updates this week as we get ready um, to start amping up our coverage. So if you're a Patreon, you're going to be first um, to get some of that starting uh, today. Um, if not, um, don't worry. Our videos come out a day later. Um, I am sorry. Again, I apologize in advance. This angle of construction is going to be very blurry. It is very far away. Um, so you're not going to be able to make out a lot. We can barely make out giant orange cones um, and colors and stuff like that. So I do apologize, especially when the sun is shining. It is going to be really hard to see from this angle, but at least it's better than nothing. With that being said, um, I do have some breaking news to start making on the project. Um, I'm really excited. It is not going to be in this video. But um, in today's video, you're going to see that they have worked their way into the mountain. Um, from what we can tell, they've knocked down that first floor wall um, that was separating the outer, outer skirt of the mountain decal. And then the inner wall was now knocked down, opening it up to a giant flat section on the inside. Um, outside of that, lots of work going on in Elpin. Um, especially in tomorrow's video, I'll be able to explain a lot more that's gone on. So there's work going on in the multi-faith building. Um, whether that's going to become a VIP area or it's going to be demolished, which it is showing signs um, to being demolished, but we'll talk about that tomorrow. Um, but outside of that, there's a lot of work going on in all the Alpen um, themed buildings. And we all know that when Cedar Fair builds a roller coaster, they typically like to refresh the entire area. So they're showing signs of that. I wonder if Wonderland's going to discuss that in um, the video that they're um, working on that should be coming out any day this week. Um, but yeah. Um, whether this is the area the coaster is going to come out of or not, um, remains a secret. Um, but outside of that, in tomorrow's video, you guys are going to get some tea drop and I'll be dropping the tea on Patreon tonight, um, about that. So if you want to learn it, um, definitely, um, head on over to Patreon. I'm going to be drawing some drawings now on the project on what's complete, like I did for Yukon and what's not. Um, and same with, uh, Snoopy's Racing Railway. So I think you guys will like that. Um, and yeah, I'm, I'm really excited. I'm, I'm excited to start telling you guys some serious things, um, as we learn them as well. Um, but yeah, outside of that, they're still working on that first tunnel, um, reinforcing it, uh, as well. Um, and a special shipment came in yesterday as well. And we will discuss what was in this shipment very soon. You won't be able to see the shipment anymore. It was packed away and hidden. This is an overseas shipping container. It did not come via the international border between the U.S. and Canada. This came internationally overseas. So um, really excited to talk about the what was in that container with you guys. But yeah. I'm going to keep that a secret for now, um, and then uh, we'll announce it on Patreon very shortly. Anyways, thanks for watching today's update. Stay tuned for tomorrow's, and obviously, Patreons, thank you for supporting the channel, and stay tuned for tonight's update. Have a good one, guys. Bye.